it go like Don't break me from so fucking done with you, girl So fucking done with all the games Hello there all of you pause some people, it's me Growling Bandit here Welcome back to our Wizard 101 Myth walkthrough If you guys don't remember last time We had to talk with the talking waterfall uh, A waterfall with, with the face With the, with the with baby face <laughs> and <laughs> now now we're in a sunken submarine or something called called storm ribbon <laughs> I don't know also how do you get this thing how do you get this boss I over the years I never figured out how to get this exact these exact bosses Like, are they part of a side quest or, or something? I don't know. <laughs> but I see a shell, and I'm getting that shell. <clears throat> so, where we, uh, where we left off, um, we were going to defeat some remnants. And after I was done recording, uh, I went ahead and defeated the remnants before I even done anything else. Like, I did a daily assignment before, as <laughs> you can see in the chat log. I kind of feel embarrassed, because I do daily assignments, of course. Okay, so I just... Now you will have to go outside to throw the lever that activates the generator. Okay. Things like not even plugged in. <laughs> like there's a plug. There's a plug right there. Okay, and we gotta defeat this guy. Outside dome. Yeah. I don't think this guy's a boss in here. I think he's just a regular monster. I don't know. I'll have to see. Now you were there. Touch that and you'll answer to me. Okay, um, I'm gonna I'm a, I'm a get rid of this. Cause there's no ghosts. There's no one dead. <laughs> Gosh, she has a lot of health though. <laughs> I think I'm gonna see his Dang it, it's gone! <laughs> I was on a roll! Like, I sneezed two episodes in a row. I'm being serious about this. I, I, I literally sneezed two episodes in a row, and suddenly I was about to sneeze this time. It, it didn't come up. Like, it was about to turn. Uh, it didn't come up. That feeling's gotta be the worst in the world. If you, if you guys don't agree with me, you're all insane. <laughs> Like, I remember on a V-Live broadcast, Jung Woo was about to sneeze, and then he was relieved that it was gone. Like, what kind of person is he? He's a crazy person! But he's cute, though, so I love him. <laughs> so, I'll, I'll let it slide this time. 
Just because he's a little heart moaner. Sorcerer Sanctum. I need to remember that. You throw the lever, and the Celestian power generator begins working once more. Okay, good. I also need to find the Lounge Lizard in the in Storm Riven at some point. Because it's somewhere in the other area in Storm Riven, right? Not Storm Riven Hall, but like where the where the Sorcerer Sanctum also is. You surprise me, Wizard. I'm impressed with what I've seen so far. Perhaps I've been unfair. Fresh start. Here. As you know, we're trying to sort out a way through the portal leading to the Lunarium, the Astral School of the Moon. The portal pieces were scattered throughout the area, and most were buried beneath the waves. If you'd like to be of further help, you could gather them up. I'm no wizard. And confess that I'm afraid to touch them. You're afraid to test the portal pieces. <laughs> they, they won't even do that much harm to you. They're like, what? They're like stone. They're stone. Oh, I can't. Well then. Wait. Oh, I'm supposed to go that way. The oh, fuck? <laughs> I know there's a portal piece, like, in the waters right here. It's a portal piece. Okay, where... To me. Ah! There's a portal piece between these guys. I don't know how I'm gonna get it. How am I gonna get it? It's like between these guys. I can't. I can't. Okay, 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 okay. Alright, I think I can do it now. Alright. And I'll, and I'll go back and I'll and I'll go back to see if the portal piece respawn there. Yeah, there we go. We got we got all the portal pieces. That's not all of them. Judging from what you found, there are at least two missing pieces of the portal. Those celestial remnants seem interested in them. Their leader is Alaric Moon Thunder. He's in the ossuary. If Moon Sunder is willing to speak with you, maybe he can tell you where the missing pieces are. No, 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 no. Get me out. Get me out. Get me out. Get me out of here. <laughs> Thank God.
never realized how how huge this place is. I sense in you great power. You are not with the expedition or with Morgant's invaders. The Celestian Wardens have long held the line against the Morgantine invaders. Even the sea could not quench our fire. When the Dark Queen of the Shadow Web came to Celestia to learn our magic, she was sent away by our wizards. She returned to take it, and our army met hers on the field of battle. We were undone done by an unreliable ally, the Storm Titan. The Storm Titan pulled Celestia beneath the waves, ending the war and hiding Celestia from the spiral for once and all. Eons later, we are still locked in a war we cannot win. Two warring planets orbiting an ever-burning sun. Oh, we're starting to learn about Morgant now. I sense that you wish to learn the secret of celestial magic, and that you have been proven worthy. My counterpart among the Morgantine forces is Kerilac Nightspinner. Go and speak to him. He will tell you more. Oh. Oh, it's a zodiac tome. The kraken lurks within the deeps of the ocean, tendrils bringing doom and woe to all. It is a sign of evil and death at sea, of dark possibility and the wild unknown of the deep. Dang, kraken. You are no Celestian. You must have spoken to Alaric Moonsunder if you sought to speak with me. Though we are enemies, we respect one another. If you seek the lost pieces of the Court of Stone, we can help one another. I do not know where they are, but I can find them. But I am unable to aid you without my Shadow Seeker Medallion, a magic talisman that lets me find whatever I seek. It, uh... it was cut from around my neck in the midst of battle by Alaric Moonsunder himself. I cannot find it now. An ironic fate. If you can find and return my Shadow Seeker medallion, I will use it to give you what you seek most. find a piece of what might be the Shadow Seeker medallion. Maybe Alaric Moonsunder knows what happened to the rest. Ah, 
relaxed medallion. I remember in the savage dance of battle, striking with my blade and cutting it from his neck. He did not notice, but his men did. They scrambled for it as if it were gold, taking the pieces for themselves. I assumed they would return them to their master when the battle was done, but they are without honor. If you wish to recover Keralak Nightspinner's Shadow Seeker medallion, you must claim the pieces from his men. Okay, then uh, we'll be right back. Okay, and we are back. So now we need to go talk to Keralak. And I finally got the lounge wizard. It was hiding like right, right around there. Like, do you see like that green name? There's a polymorph trainer. The lounge lizard, the lounge lizard was beside that. So it cannot be. You have returned that which could not be found. You have returned the pieces of my medallion, but it is still broken. Can you place it upon that nearby pedestal? That will restore its energy flow and enable it to be of use to us. Okay. Oh, we gotta fight him, do we? Oh, okay. I I need a I need a I need a hold on. <laughs> I need to get my I need to get my health back. Health back. Health back. <laughs> Lights are on. <laughs> if you guys don't know that reference, I don't even know what's wrong with you. Okay, I'm gonna go use the pestle now. You have restored my Shadow Seeker medallion, and with it, my power is restored. You think you seek the missing portal pieces, but you are wrong. If you came to this sunken place, it must be in search of your doom. Did you really think I would put aside centuries of hate to help you? No, oh, God. We got to beat this guy. We got no good treasure cards. It's gonna be bad. It's fine. We can do this. We can do this. No, we can't. <laughs> boy oh no don't you dare don't you dare okay thank god <laughs>
Okay. That thing's gone. All right, now we gotta deal with the boss. Okay, um, there. <laughs> oh, gosh. Two hundred health left. I don't know if this is gonna be good or bad. Just need to get a power pip next round. Come on. No. Urgh! I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh my gosh. Okay. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. Come on, come on, come on, crown shop, open up, open up, open up. Oh, thank God. No, don't do that! Yeah, use that, like that's gonna help.
Come on. Always hated this boss. <laughs> the irony is thick. You have given me what I sought most my own destruction. When Carolac Night Spinner falls, he drops a piece of the Celestian portal. <sighs> Thank God that's over. You've got it. That can't be an easy find. You've got all but the last fragment of the portal spell. Don't be discouraged. It's more than any of us got. As you know, much of what we do is dig around in search of broken bits and fragments of data, usually far less important. You've earned a rapport with the Morgantine soldiers trapped in this grave. It's quite remarkable how you did that. I've spoken with one of them, a fellow named Vasic Shadowspite. Don't let the name fool you. He's quite friendly. Go and speak with him in Storm Riven Hall. He might be of help finding that last portal piece. There we go. <laughs> Look at this thing. It's big. Well, don't stop the ceiling. Now dive it, dive it, dive it.
don't look Marleybonian, and you're no Celestial. The one named Leland Hawkins sent you? Very well, then. I will aid you in recovering the remaining portal piece. Long ago, when the portal was broken up, the final piece was taken and given to a being called Tempest Stormfist. Stormfist is a servant of the powerful Storm Titan that sunk Celestia beneath the waves, and he is dangerous beyond measure. Storm Rivenhall had three gems called the Storm Shards, when together they called the Storm Titan's avatar. After Celestia sunk, the Storm Shards were taken by water lurkers and Morgantine soldiers. One of them was lost in rubble. If you can recover the three lost Storm Shards, bring them back and place them within the carved Kraken statue. Okay, so I'm gonna leave this episode here. Next episode, I might have someone with me. I might get Danny to come back, because I haven't had him in an episode in, like, quite some time. <laughs> or along in the summer at all. So, so next episode, I might have him back. Or someone else, if I can't get him back. So, thank you all so much for watching. As always, if you guys did enjoy this episode, wanna be a possum person, I uh, found that like button. I will see all of you possum people in the next video. Oh, my God.